on this day in working class history, the 27th of October. On the 27th of October 1948, a two-week wildcat strike of New York City brewery workers had grown to 3,500 people. Two of the city's brewers then decided to abandon the Board of Trade's collective position and agreed to the strikers' demands to drop a punitive scheduling system which gave drivers insufficient time to unload their vehicles. Meanwhile, ten other breweries went on the offensive, suing the United Brewery Workers' Union for up to $10 million each, despite the union ordering the strikers to return to work and requesting injunctions against pickets. But the strikers held out and eventually won. For sources, maps, and all of our anniversaries each day, check out the On This Day section of our Stories app at stories.workingclasshistory.com. And if you value our work, support us at patreon.com slash workingclasshistory. Links in the show notes. Theme music by Ricardo Areia. See you tomorrow.